Hello everyone, so today we want to just look at how to move from this default asymmetric triple window and make it this nice uh, well divided triple window glass. So I'll go to the ground floor. So I have this wall already created and I have those two samples to show you the difference. So what we want to do is to go to the window settings. So double click on that. And this is the preview, the ones that I have already created. But let me select another one and select this one as well, such that, you know, we go back to the defaults, which you will get when you open. So here in preview and positioning is where you put in the sizes that you want to see. So for my case, it's going to be about 1.8 by 1.5. And this is how far it is from the ground. So you can change it. Maybe 900 could work for me. Here you can reveal the wall core. So I like to reveal something like 75 and you can see that that has been reviewed on the outside so next is under basic window settings this is where you change the shape so click on this icon here and scroll up and you will see the shape here so under the shape this is where you determine and remove it from being asymmetric by clicking here and changing it to uniform glazing sizes so that's all you have to do to have those uniform sizes. And next is I like to go to the frame widths and keep them as uniform because, you know, it doesn't look nice with different frames, but you do whatever you wish. And after that, I like to go to the search options. This is very important. You go to the middle one and leave it at no grid. And the side one, you can change it to HV grid where you determine and say that horizontally it's going to be a one single pin and vertically it's going to be about three of them. Uh, why am I doing that? It's because if I show you on this one here, you, I'd like to just divide side this side, side one and side two or whichever you can number them. But side one needs to have three pens and side two needs to have the three pens. That's all. And that's the figure that I'm choosing for here. So side two as well, I'd like to come here and change it to HV grid and have three pens there and one horizontally. And right here in the thickness, you can put in the thickness you want to see. Since it's metal, I will consider something like 30. So from there, I'd like to go to the opening lines, which you can override and uncheck them because I don't usually like to see those lines in 3D, opening lines in 3D. And then finally, we can change what it looks like as a model here in uniform window surface. We can check that such that we are able to change all of them at once. So press M and we are there. This is where the metal aluminium is. And that's the material I've chosen. So I'll say OK and I'll go ahead and put that in right there. So if I go to 3D, um, the window that we have just put in is isolated here. So these are the changes we have made. But by default, you get something like this. So that's it. Uh, that's an easy way you can create this uh, special custom triple window. So thank you so much for watching and I'll catch you in the next one.